hey baby, what's going on? Look at how happy they are. Uh, baby? Oh, right, I forgot. Uh, I'll turn on the alt text text to speech. A photo of Mr. Butters and his loving wife, Mrs. Cheese Wheel, happily embracing their three children, Cream, Cool Whip, and Half and Half. Oh, what about it? Well, I don't know, Ballora. I'm happy for them and all, but just look at how loving their family is. Or, well, I, I can picture it in my head. Okay, well, just like look at how happy their family is. I don't know. It just makes me feel stuck. Well, you were into Freddy for a bit there, weren't you? Mm, yeah. Are you still? Mm, kinda. Alright, baby. Let's talk. Girl to girl. Uh, alright. Listen, what didn't work with Freddy before? I don't know. I guess maybe I didn't put a whole lot of effort or thought into it. But also, he never really reciprocated my love like that. I don't know if he was just focused on other things, or... It's just maybe I realized he doesn't really like me. Or maybe he never really tried to like me. I don't know. Why don't you give it another shot? You sound really unsure about it. Maybe you just need some closure or some confirmation. I guess you bring up a good point. But I don't know how to set up something like that again. I don't know if I can go through it by myself. Hmm. I have an idea. Let me go give someone a call. Uh, okay. All right, you should be getting a call in a few minutes. Wait, w what? Uh, but I haven't, uh, I haven't even prepared anything. Nah, don't worry. I'm sure you two can figure it out. Ooh, I think that's it now. Uh, you know what, Ballora? It's probably just something for a doctor's appointment or something. Uh -huh, we don't have to do this. Answer the phone, dummy. Ah! Uh, okay. Uh, hello? Uh, hey, uh, circus baby. Uh, how's everything going? Uh, pretty good. How about you? You're doing great. Yeah, so, uh, I know it's been a while since we last talked about this whole thing. Um, I kind of realized that I was being a bit of an asshole about your feelings for me. And even if I didn't necessarily feel the same way, I didn't really bother giving it an attempt to... Uh, so I figured that if you still felt the same way about me, that I would give it another shot. Um, and just to let you know, I definitely was not ushered and pressured by Chica to do this because she had the situation explained to her. Uh, that definitely didn't happen. And I'm just kind of, you know, reiterating that, just in case you weren't aware. Also, to let you know, she didn't threaten to hit me over the head with a pot. That didn't happen either. Cast iron, by the way. Definitely would've hurt like a bitch. Uh, just wanted to kind of tell you that, and just let you know. Um, if you want, maybe we can go on a date tonight. I think that would be fun. Um, uh, uh, uh yeah. I, I love you. Is that too early? Is that too soon? Too soon? Whatever, you already said it. Uh, okay, uh, bye. <sighs> Why do you hang up so abruptly? You were scaring me! Oh, oh, okay, uh, bye. I think you already hung up. Huh. Alright, well, we can give it one more shot. Yay, I'm so happy for you! Oh, man. Jeez, what kind of strings did you have to pull to get that to happen? I'll never tell. I don't want to break your immersion. Aw, thanks, Ballora. You know, even if this doesn't work out, it would be nice to get some closure. Yeah, of course. Now, excuse me, I have to go call Chica back. Oh, uh, all right. Wait a minute. Well, I think that went well. <sighs> Man, I didn't think Baby's feelings for me were this serious. Freddy, I just don't know why you never bothered giving her any attention. I don't know. Maybe I just never really thought I was a fit for romance. I just figured that people didn't really like me. I mean, have you never not wanted it? I mean, I've definitely given it a thought. It's just never really been a huge concern of mine. Well, I guess this is a good opportunity to find out if it's really for you or not. True. I should give this my whole effort, just to see if it really works out. Yeah, why not? Did you really have to use the pot? Well, I, you know, I just want to make sure it got through to you. <sighs> Alright, well, I'm gonna go put on my best hat and bow tie. Go get him, tiger! <sighs> I did a good thing. Ooh, my phone's ringing. 
Yeah, Frederick T. Theodore Fazbear. Now you, my friend, are one smoking hot guy. <laughs> you got this in the bag, baby. Yeah, Fred, you got that swagger. You got that riz. Freddy, please never say that again. What, is that not what the kids say nowadays? It is, and that's why it scares me. Oh, what do you know? I'm still hip and cool. <laughs> ah, I slipped a disc! Jesus, Freddy, you gonna be okay? Yes, I'm fine, I'm fine. Ow, okay. Ah, all right, I'm just gonna go to this date. <sighs> Bonnie, can you be my wingman? What? Your wingman? Dude, I don't know the first thing about being a wingman. I'd say Chica's more for that sort of thing, but, you know, that's a girl. No, I don't mean literally wings. I just feel like you got that youthful spunk to you that would allow women to be attracted to you. I don't know, man. I feel like you should just be yourself. See, and that's exactly why you're my wingman. Huh. Guess you're right. Guess I am kind of good at this thing. All right, man. I'll riz her up for you so then you can slide right in. Oh, man. I love riz. Okay. Nope. This is... That's where... That's where we stop. All right, let's go. Is this the second episode in a row where we made a joke about some kind of gen alpha term? Yes, that is that is that is true. Ah! Ooh, hi, Mr. Butters. Well, what's up? Hey, so me and the missus want to go out on a date tonight. Hi, Ennard. Uh, oh, uh, hi, ma'am. And uh, we kind of got a little eensy weensy teensy little favor to ask you. What is it? Well, we want some alone time, and we wanted to ask you if you could babysit our three little sweet darling children. Oh, uh, well, I mean, I guess I can not have anything to do tonight. Sure, um, are they that much trouble? Nah, Mr. Butters, they're like sweet little darling angels. It'll be like they're not even here. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess, if, sure. To be honest, I probably owe you something that I've done in the past. I tend to forget these things a lot, so I'll do a favor for you for once. Aw, thanks, pal. All right, come in, you three. All right, kids, me and your mother are going to go on a date tonight. We want to have some alone time, because we spend a lot of time taking care of you three. Even if we love you very much, we need some alone time. So, Uncle Ennard is going to take care of you. Hi, I'm Ennard. Daddy, he's weird. Cream, what are your manners? Be nice to Uncle Ennard. He's doing a favor for me. And, you know, he's a good friend. Okay. Oh, wait, so what are their names? Oh, yeah, I guess I should introduce them. All right, this is Half and Half, this is Cool Whip, and this is Cream. You can tell them apart by their hair. Yeah, whatever, man. All right, well, don't have too much fun while we're gone. Thank you so much, Ennard. Have a good evening. Ah, these kids won't be too much trouble. I invented crazy science machines and stuff. You know, what can three kids be trouble? Okay, thanks, bye. That's kind of abrupt. Hey, kids, so uh, what do you guys like to do for fun? Pager! I need the pager! Help me! Help! Ow! Okay, we were having a nice drink, you know. What do you want? Yeah, nerd, what the hell? What the? Ugh, did Mr. Butters' butters get loose again? No! These are his kids and they're monsters! Ah! Help me! <sighs> this is going to be a long night. Yeah. All right, baby, you can do this. <sighs> oh, hi there, ma'am. Uh, what can I do for you? Hi, sir. Um, I'd like a table for two, please. Uh, I'm on a date, but I guess he's just not here yet. All right. Um, it appears we don't have any more tables for two. However, we do have an incomplete table for four back there if you'd like to split it with another couple. Oh, uh, all right. Well, I'll see the harm in it. All right, ma'am. Follow me this way. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Here's your seat, ma'am. All right, nice and comfy. So then I said to him, you ever seen two kids? Try handling three. <laughs> Gosh, and really babies as assistants, don't they? Huh? Oh, hey, baby. Great. Can I get you started with something to drink? Uh, no, I think I'll wait for my date to get here. All right, I'll see you in a bit. So what are you doing here all by your lonesome? Well, if I had to let you know, Mr. Butters, I'm actually here on a date with someone. Really? What is he? Well, he's not here yet, but I mean, he will be soon. Wow! A girl like you getting a guy. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. What is that supposed to mean? Exactly what I said. I never thought I'd see the day. Ugh! Please get here soon, Freddy. Oh, I hope our food gets here soon. I love you, honey. Mm -hmm. 
so that's how they kiss. Huh. Weird. Mm, I don't know about this. Ugh. Come on, Freddy. It's just like I said. I'll butter her up for you, and then you can slide in for the kill. Are you sure, Bonnie? I don't know if this is a good idea. I told you, man. I got it for the girls. They're a lot more prone to your romantic advances as long as they got a little bit of, you know, pep in their step. They got to get a warm-up. I'm the warm-up. You're the main course. Just let me do my thing. <sighs> All right. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Is this seat taken? Huh? Oh, hey. Um, well, and my date's supposed to sit there, so yeah, it kind of is. Is your date here? Well, not yet, but then I don't think it's taken. Okay, did the waiter direct you to sit over here? Pfft, come on, babe. Who needs a waiter when you got all this? Ah, Bonnie, please, we're in public. So, what kind of hobbies are you into? Oh, well, I mean, uh, I play games sometimes. I like to read. Uh, I'm into baking. I also like to make a lot of ice cream. Wait, are you trying to hit on me? Give me some sugar, baby. <laughs> 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 that was weird. What the heck was that? I uh, buttered her up just like a piece of toast. Ugh. I'm gonna go sit down. Hello, my good man. What can I do for you? Oh, oh, uh, hi. I'm actually here to see my date. Uh, she's sitting right over there. Oh, okay. Come, let me direct you to your seat. I like the way your voice sounds, by the way. Really? I like the way your voice sounds, too. Aw, thanks. Don't mention it. Hi, baby. Oh, hey, Freddy. Ooh, I'm glad you're here. I like your dress. You look nice. Uh, thanks. I like your hat and bow tie. It looks really nice. Well, I'm glad you noticed. All right, you two. Can I get you started with something to drink? Uh, I'll take a water. Chocolate milk. Okay, a water and a chocolate milk. I'll also be here with your two main course in a minute. Thank you, sir. Hi, Freddy. Oh, hi, Miss Cheese Wheel. How are the kids? Pretty good, pretty good. Oh, little bundles of joy. And it's babysitting them tonight while me and Mr. Butters are out. Yeah. So, baby, you're dating Freddy Fazbear, huh? <sighs> well, we're on a date, so I, I guess. Hmm. The one and only. Say, baby, what you been up to this week? Oh, uh, well, you know, my usual thing. Just kind of moping around, not doing a whole lot. You know, hanging out with the gang and stuff. It's been nice, but I don't know. I think I've fallen into a bit of a routine. It's just kind of monotonous i suppose really you know i kind of feel the same way really yeah i mean i don't know i think i'm just looking for something new to do <sighs> just having shared experiences with my friends or whoever it may be yeah pizzeria ain't been as lively as it once was it gets quiet ah! <laughs> oh it's so funny <laughs> i know what was so funny to the two of you? Oh, I, I, you wouldn't get it. Uh, you wouldn't get it. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> hey, I mean, what have you wanted to do to try and shake things up? I don't know. I uh, went on a vacation with everybody recently, and it got me thinking about a lot. Really? Like what? Already, I got a water and a chocolate milk. Please, so I got the hot plate. Get the food on there, yes, sir. Oh, oh, this is for the Butters and his wife? Yes, Mr. Hotcake, it is already for you serving. Oh, all right, uh, thanks. They're going to understand what the fine cuisine is meant for there. They are going to taste the food and realize I'm the best chef in the world. I'm cooking the food for them. It is really delicious and tasty. I don't understand a word of what he just said, but I think it was smart because he was using a nice accent. Uh, see if I can carry all this at the same time. I do not want to make two trips. Oh, that's hilarious. Typical shenanigans around my place. Man, I can't believe you faced against a snowman. That's just... I know weird stuff happens every day around here, but... Ugh. Yeah, I know. It does make me wonder, though. Seems like our lives are filled with chaotic stuff every day, but... I can't understand why I feel like my life's monotonous. Yeah, I kind of can't either. It's weird. Dude, watch out, it's a hot plate! <laughs> Dinner, right on cue. Ooh, it looks delicious. Ah! My dress! Ah! Oh, 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 I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't want to have to make two trips. <sighs> hey, baby, it's just a little water. You still look great. <laughs> really? Yeah. I got my chalky milk. That's what matters the most. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> ah! mm. Yeah, 
I suppose. I'll be over with the menus in just a moment so you two can get started on your meal. <laughs> what were we talking about again? Oh, uh, just life stuff, you know, monotony. Oh yeah, that. You know, maybe there is a level of monotony to chaos, you know? Just never really finding your footing. I don't know. Maybe part of me just never really realized that I want to work towards something more than just the status quo. Yeah, I guess the status quo can be chaotic. I want something more with permanence, you know? Yeah, I mean, I agree. Definitely got some things I want to kick off my bucket list. I mean, if you're comfortable with sharing, why not? I'll share some of mine too. Well, uh, I've always wanted to learn how to roller skate. Oh, do the sea. Oh, do the sea. I'm going to boil you and just season you so perfectly. Hey, uh, bro, where are the menus at? Ugh, you didn't understand if there are no menus here, then you have given them all the way out to the customers. You have to go and collect them from people to give them to new people. Stupid. Oh, almost forgot about that. I'll be back. You better. Ugh, need some more salt. Ugh. How do I get this off without no arms? Why does everything on this menu have really fancy French names and then for some reason just English text below it? Like, just put the English text there. It's to make it look like it's fancier. I'm still deciding. I don't really know what I want. Mm. Well, I already know what I want. You want to try some of mine? And unless someone snatches the menus out of our hands, I'd like to look a little more. Yeah, that's understandable. Ah, emergency! Uh, these menus have cook uh, uh, disease on them. I have to go get them to someone else. What? What the? What? You know what? I already know what I want. When the waiter comes back around, we'll just order two of what I want, and then maybe you'll like it. <sighs> I hope so. Hey, don't stress about it. I've got a pretty normal palate. Okay, yeah. Okay. There's two menus. Uh, please be quick, because I kind of have to play musical chairs with these. What the heck does that mean? I don't know. I guess we'll just order. Hmm, let's see here. Uh, huh? Oh, that was delicious. I know. I love you. Mm. <sighs> Man, they're obnoxious. Hmm. Hey, baby, you want to order something exciting? What do you mean? You know, something to distract from Loverbird 1 and 2 over there. Uh, I mean, I, I guess I would kind of get my mind off of it. Hmm. You know that thing where the chef's cook in front of you? Why don't we get a hibashi or whatever that thing is? Is that on the menu? I don't know, but hey, I mean, if we tip them enough, they'll do anything for us. This place is fancy. I'm sure they can figure it out. Are you sure you're prepared to afford that? Eh, I can make some sacrifices. Besides, anything to get their slurping out of my right ear. <laughs> Alright, fine, we'll go with it. <sighs> Alright, what have you two wanted? Sir, can we take a hibashi order, please? Uh, what's that? Uh, that's when the chef cooks in front of you. Uh, guys, with all due respect, I don't think we do that here. I can tip you pretty generously if you're offering. How much? Mm, 10% extra, on top of the normal 20. So, 30% tip. Mm, make it 40. Okay, hold on. 32. That's my highest offer. 33 or no deal. Really need that extra 1%? Fine. I'll get your abashi in about 15 minutes, give or take. Uh, I don't really know how long a YouTube video teaching me how to do that would be. Oh, uh, waiter, can we please get an ice cream? Uh, one ice cream, two spoons. Huh? Uh, all right, sure. You guys gonna eat out of the same ice cream? Of course, we do everything together. I never leave you, cream cheese. And I never leave you, butter boy. I'm gonna throw up. Uh, okay, we need to get the to toasted fish. Uh, oh shit, I want to out. Uh, oh fuck, it's hot. Uh, okay, I think they got the dirt off. Uh, can you serve up an ice cream real fast? We got a special order in. Yeah, what are you doing? Do not touch my cookware. Relax, bro, I got this. I'm about to make some mean tips here. Uh, well, I better get my half or I'm going to throw you in the guillotine. <laughs> French Revolution style. <laughs> some joke about the French. Alrighty, here's the two, uh, ice cream, one ice cream, two spoons, two cream, one ice cream, uh, I don't know. We'll be right back with your two's robachi. Thank you. Uh, guys, this is yours. Mm. Oh, I didn't even notice it was here. Ah, uh, uh, can y'all pass it over? Thank you, dearie. <sighs> Open wide, butter boy. <laughs> Just cringed. <laughs> so, what really do you want to do with your life? Just out of curiosity. I don't know. Maybe it's just settle down with someone. 
find something to do that makes me and a lot of other people happy. I think that's the only thing you can really ask for. What about you? Yeah. Me too. Okay, everybody, move out of the way. Here we go. How about you coming through? Oh, uh, here's our food. All right, here it is. Is it supposed to be smoking like that? I think so. Okay, here you guys go. There you go. Okay. Okay, that's, uh, smells a little burnt. Eh, not bad. Oh, I almost forgot. They said to spray cooking spray on top of it for garnish. Uh, are you sure about that? Yeah, the guy in an egg profile picture. I think he knew what he was doing. What you need to mail is so old, you dumbass! We didn't even get to order anything. You know what? Do you want to just, like, go get fast food or something? <sighs> yeah, let's go try a different place another night. Yeah, come on, girl. Dude, everybody move out of the way! Oh, okay. Oh. Here, we're at the ladder. Okay. Here, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay. Let me go. There's still smoke in my lungs. Ugh, me too. <sighs> that was a disaster. I mean, yeah, the fire kind of sucked, but otherwise I had a pretty good time. What are you talking about? I don't know. Maybe I just had my expectations set too high, but that wasn't really everything I imagined it to be. Well, I mean, the way I figure, you can have your idealist romantic fantasies filled with love and kissing and all the mushy-gushy stuff that everyone really hates to watch when you're not the two doing it. I hear you there. But that's not for everyone. And for what it's worth, I had a good time. I got to hear and see a Saudi I don't get to see often. We got to laugh, we got to share a sentimental moment, and I think we both learned something. For what it's worth, I'd call that the best date I've ever been on. Really? Not every day is going to be filled with sunshines and rainbows, baby. I learned that a long time ago. I think the best experiences are the most honest ones. <laughs> that felt like a pretty honest experience to me. Huh. Huh. And you know, I kind of want to be your boyfriend. What? I kind of want to be your boyfriend. Come on, man, spit it out! I kind of want to be your boyfriend. There, I said it. Oh, Freddy Fazbear. Can I be your girlfriend? I mean, shoot. Who else am I talking to? <laughs> Come on. Let's go get a dessert or something. The, the fact that those two were eating ice cream actually made me really in the mood for it. I agree. 